The highly anticipated $959 million tax package now awaits the governor's signature. While supporters say it will make the state's code more equitable, the tax reform also includes an alcohol tax increase. We just hope that with a state that is, has more money than they've ever had, um, they would consider not putting taxes on the citizens at this point. An increase White says could cause more harm than good. They're already paying more for everything they get in their restaurants. And now to have an, adi an additional tax on um, something that they've already been paying more for is, is kind of adding insult to injury. However, Pete Cassettas with Downshift Brewing says otherwise. Okay, legislature, you've done this. Um, you've done it during a surplus uh, in budget, fine. But now make it work. And that's all we ask. The alcohol tax increase would impose a one cent per drink increase on beer and nearly a two cent per drink increase on spirits. Supporters of the bill say the extra tax revenue will go toward alcohol treatment programs, an incentive Cassettes believes is needed in New Mexico. We know we have a high rate of um, DWIs and fatalities uh, and substance abuse. But we also have a, a massive issue with homelessness and uh, the lack of uh, entities that address treatment for people with mental issues or alcohol or substance abuse. Let's get those in place.